here I have a picture of a cat that I'm going to drop in and as you can see here automatically it will take the picture and then cut out the background depending on this rectangle here that it has determined so it's going to focus on your subject now keep in mind when you're using this the smaller the square you use the better the photo cutout effect will be because if the square is too big essentially the object won't be as clear because it's trying to detect too much so when you upload the photo to the app you also want to make sure that um, the, the more plain uh, background you have and the more concise background you have it's easier for it to detect that versus you know something that has a ton of complex stuff going on in the background so you can see here I'm gonna go ahead and just isolate the tail one like just the cat's head here so I'm gonna go ahead and close it in again make it smaller here to kind of make it more precise just you can take any one of the four corners here and just kind of drag it to your liking here and you can see here I'm closing in on the cat's head and you can see it did a really good job of just isolating the cat's head and taking out all of that grass here now that being said, if I want to clean it up a little bit, I can use these marker tools, for example, like the red one right here, and just color right here. And you can see there it cuts out perfectly, and then you can see I have a tiny bit right there. And right there I have a perfect cat head now, and it's that simple and that easy. Now you also have some other tools, like I said, you can add, you can add uh, a mark the foreground area, I should say, uh, versus taking or marking the background area and taking that away. Um, of course, you can clear any of the marks you made. You can adjust the marker size to get those bigger, uh, the bigger pen size or smaller pen size to allow you to fit into those little tighter areas or whatever it may be. At the bottom here, you have the ability that you can see, you can see your photo and the one-to-one, -one, the normal view. You can adjust those. You can also, of course, this is the transparent background we're using, but you can change the background color. So if I wanted to add a background color to the cat here, you can see I can do all sorts of fun colors.